Greetings gamers! I've been working on a new game called Incoming. Incoming is a 3D VR missile defense game. Protect your cities with a wide assortment of defenses against waves of warheads, bombers, zeppelins, and epic bosses. Wishlist today on Steam. Link is in the description. Greetings, witches and wizards, and welcome to more Hogwarts Legacy and Cobalt Thorium. Whoa. All right. Uh, there's a place that we're supposed to go here and do our waiting thing. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? The what? What are you talking about? Are those what those things are? Anyway, uh, hold on one second here. Let me check my volume levels. Test, test. Looks all right. Let's go. Is everything all right? Yes. I'm sorry. I'm just. I'm Nelly, by the way. I'm just so excited that the Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Hmm. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Why would Professor Moll conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's a poltergeist. I thought they could go almost anywhere. Surely you'll be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, uh, I've tried. And I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. Well, I'm not going to tell you you're a Gryffindor. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. All I right. hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. And here I thought that she was talking about those owls. All right. Um, hmm. So is that part of the main quest or is this a new side quest? Do we have new side quests? Do we have a key here? I vaguely remember black flags being places with quests. It would be great if there were a key. There isn't one. I wonder if you might be able to help me with a small, uh, project. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course, confronting trolls and dragons. We'll be conceded. Oh, that's nice to hear. I've had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a... a puff scheme. 
What is the puff skein? They're adorable. Why would you be afraid of a puff skein? They seem adorable until one sticks its tongue up your nose. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff skeins to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. Hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. Everett said the same thing. <laughs> anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think since I have been in the hidden herbology corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. Oh, jeez. So, he... He's going to prove that he's brave by not going into the dangerous corridor and something else there instead. I don't actually want to do this. What sort of plant should I expect in the hidden herbology corridor? I haven't a clue. But have you seen the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her, I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. Well, I don't have another choice, so... Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Revelio. Alright. Hmm. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Sounds intriguing. So, one other thing I'm not a huge fan of is that when you get a new quest, it takes over as your main quest. As opposed to doing the quest that you're trying to do, which is what? Oh boy. I don't, remember, I don't even re remember what we were planning to do. I don't want to go to flying class yet. Oh, it's probably the keys. Let's go for it. Revelio. Help me. Hello. Were you calling me? I was, yes. Thought you might be interested in joining me for a bit of an adventure. Following a treasure map, to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Following a Hogwarts treasure map. Count me in. Wonderful. 
Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm. Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. All right, so that's the front of the rhinoceros. Then we have a... So this is the courtyard, I think. There's a door back there. Ah. I'm not really sure what to make of this dragon or snake climbing down a pole. It looks like this is pull on this, which is a painting of a house. I don't recognize it, though. Alright, let's head to the... Uh, we know exactly where the... Um, rhinoceros is. I shouldn't Handy say exactly, because I don't know exactly. Field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. I don't know exactly in, in that I walked by it. <laughs> it's going to be down. Excuse me. Down one more flight. just to get away from Professor Black and his iron fist. But then I remember that I don't speak French. Man, we're picking up a lot of new quests here. Odds and ends. You. It took us three days to find your brother, and your mother always... There it is. Hmm. Huh. A rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Revelio. Door. I'm getting closer. Should be a tall, tall painting somewhere with a latch at the top. It's like a painting of like a cottage. What room is this? It looks like a classroom. All right, that's not it. Goblin artifact. Horns like this were used by goblins during the 1612 Goblin Rebellion to rally troops and generally annoy witches and wizards. 
The horn was discovered in the aftermath of the rebellion behind the Hogshead Inn with a wedge of Gargonzola stuffed inside, presumably, presumably to mute it. Revelio. Scorch Mount. Allegedly the location of the first known instance of an arguably successful casting of Bombarda, date unknown, caster unidentifiable. There's the house. I like how the parallax on it is kind of funky. Didn't work. to do here. Hmm. It says to go down. A beginner actually. guide. This stairwell looks promising. A rather important. Did I come in from an this unexpected angle? This looks like the angle? portrait from the map. Now, where's the treasure? Here. So now it works, huh? Aha! There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. I hated learning banishment. Never had such a thing. Let me know. That's right, I changed it. Sphinx around somewhere. For a sphinx. It's not going to be in there. 
My parents visited the school once. All of them said... Dancing bulbs get big, they can be quite strong. I can deny you don't get one that's too mature, or you'll be having to cast the fire making spell. And I'm sure that won't go over well if garlic tells black. Revelia. Broken broom. This broken broom belonged to Celine Wart Wartnaby and is rumored to be all that remains after she insisted upon demonstrating her experimental lunar apparition charm to fellow third years. No one knows if she succeeded. Pavelio. I might have to scoot here. I am getting tired. There we go. Flattened armor. This set of armor belonged to Sir Hagglesthorpe, the headless, or the heedless rather, who unwisely challenged a mountain troll to a game of musical chairs. Yeah, I'm looking around, still looking around for something that looks sphinxy. A lot of the artifacts in this area here are def definitely. What are you up to now? Ethnic. It's my favorite thing from the entire school. If I didn't have that, do I think I should be You could hear Shah talking about it. Yeah, I don't know. I think I've got to wrap it up here. I'm just too tired. I'm gonna... I'm not thinking clearly. And... Yeah, it's a little rough. So, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm sorry that this episode is so short. Um... But if you liked it anyway, please like, maybe comment, maybe share, maybe subscribe. New episodes every day at 4 p.m. Eastern Time in US and Canada. My name is Cobalt Thorium, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.